Okay. All right, hi folks, Mickey Brown again here, Southeastern Marine, and we are looking at the brand new for 2021 Ultra 265 Sea Hunt SE Special Edition in the brand new hull color, Atlantic Green, new for 2021 at Sea Hunt's newest dealer here in Richmond, Virginia. Mickey Brown, Southeastern Marine new for 2021. So let's take a quick video walkthrough of some of the nice features on this boat. What we're gonna start with is we're gonna start with this huge amount of Carolina flare that I'm standing underneath and this 60 degree dead rise here at the bow, as well as we're gonna focus on this through hull anchor. See, they've taken the best things out of the 275 and brought it down into a smaller scale. Whereas on the 255, we've got the anchor wheel that's going over the nose. So going through the nose gives us more bow seating, and we're gonna see that when we climb up on board. We're gonna climb in through this side entry door. This is a standard feature on all of Sea Hunt's full windshield models, the 239, the 255, the 265, the 275, and the new Ultra 305 all have this nice side entry door. So let's climb up and take a look. Once we get on up here, you're gonna see the double VIP companion vent seat in the back. And we're gonna take a look at this ultra entertainment leaning post. But we've got dual VIP companion seats. And I tell you, I love this ultra entertainment leaning post with these kick rests. I can kick my feet up, relax tell somebody which way they need to drive while I'm back, back here, back seat driving. We've got storage in the cabinet here. We've got a slide out Yeti down here. Easy to slide with just one hand. Grab a beverage and put right back. Plenty of storage up under all three of these compartments. Again, dual VIP seats, plus there's still a door where we can enter and exit the watercraft. Back here, another cool feature, and this is brand new stuff. 2021 on these motors is electric steering. So we've got Yamaha's independent electric steering and we can whip that steering wheel back and forth real quickly at a dock with zero effort. That comes into handy and is an integral part if you wanted to add a joystick docking system or the Hellmaster EX as you can add that to anything 25 foot twin engine and bigger straight from the factory at Sea Hunt Boats and they will put a joystick at the dash of this boat. But let's take a look at the new Ultra Entertainment Leaning Post. This has got a nice Corian countertop, freshwater sink, plenty of cup holders. They've done a really good job. There's integrated trash can storage over there. And if you come on over here, we got a built-in bar. We've got wine glasses, we've got ice trays. We're ready to make a drink and maybe even cut some cheese. Have a nice little cheese and crackers party with a bottle opener to boot. So fully stocked bar, almost. It'll be fully stocked as, as part of our dealer prep. And uh, we can have some fun with it. Up here at the helm, again, electric steering wheel. So I can whip this wheel with zero resistance whatsoever from the factory, so it's very, very easy. You can set a brake on it. We've got Yamaha's brand new CL5 command link touchscreen display integrated right here at the dash, ready to go. You can see this boat sitting here ready to go. All we gotta do is knock it in gear, and look, she's even full of fuel, just waiting for somebody to come take it home with them. Garmin GPS Fish Finder 1242 XSV, one of my favorite features in the XSV Touch Plus is the auto guidance system is now built in standard. So they've done a very good job of offering us auto guidance, but in a very economical price point unit already installed from the factory. We got the marine mat up here. I can throw my wallet. Actually, that's not my wallet. That's my wallet. Throw the wallet up there, throw some keys up there, and we can go 30 miles an hour out in the ocean and that stuff's gonna sit right there because it's gripped, gripped down in place actuator on our fully tempered glass windshield so we can let a little bit of air in or we can seal that thing down and on this 265 up here we've got the Garmin VHF radio already integrated into another dash mount as well as we've got spreader lights in the back plus spreader lights in the front plus courtesy lights 
Again, favorite feature on these boats has got to be the onboard mister system. This hard top turns into Disney World just like that, and you can mist down the kids, keep them happy, keep them cool, keep everybody uh, out on the water a little longer. Plus, we've got an awesome JL Audio stereo system on board, wireless phone holder to boot, and uh, of course, six speaker JL Audio upgradable above and beyond. And the neat part is, with just a couple button presses, we could pull up our Yamaha gauges on this one on this single multifunction display, or we can also turn that stereo up right here. Or turn it down if you don't like what we're listening to, like now. Uh, moving forward, we do, of course, I did fail to mention, we do have Yamaha's new Helmmaster EX throttle, digital throttle and shift right here at the, uh, at the helm, as well as start-stop keys, so latest and greatest Yamaha rigging like you'd see on much more expensive boats. And you know what? I failed to actually show off this leaning post. Same rules apply. Three different step panels, gator step here, Sea Hunt logo embroidered there, um, as well as a seat, an armrest, or a fold up bolster, just like that. Very, very, very good features. So, as well, the, the upholstery here on the Sea Hunt is a waffle comb design, so any dirt, say, from the fact that it's all wet, my hands might have a little dirt, sits right on top of the surface, so it's very easy to wipe that off and keep this stuff good and clean. Come on over, let's take a look inside the head. We got a vacuum flush head inside of here. We've also got storage for the side entry ladder in here. Uh, you can see those courtesy lights, both blue lights and white lights, as well as a battery charger already on board here from Southeastern Marine, already installed down there. We've got the forward seating up here as we move forward. And we've got these hump seats that you see are very, very comfortable up here. As well as we've got the bow beverage center. We've got the integrated uh, filler cushion right here that fills in this whole area. It makes it real nice to sit up here, relax, and head for a water, water ride. Integrated windlass through the nose up front, plus we've got button controls up there. Underneath me, if we pull this cushion up and we take a look, is a, a big old 140-some quart fish box on either side, plus down below us, you can see we've got all the safety gear in here too. All, every sea hunt boat that comes out of here, you're gonna get life preservers, flares, throw cushion, fire extinguisher, all the necessary things to get out on the water and use this boat. Plus, under here, we've got over 200 quarts of in-floor storage as well. So there's another storage access up in the front hull of this boat. Bow Beverage Center makes it nice if you're entertaining. Got the cushions all back out. And you're going to notice you're not going to struggle to find a cup holder or a cup holder rod holder. And one of the biggest winning features on these Sea Hunt boats is this heavy duty hardware, um, big cleats, big cup holders. Everything's thought through thoroughly. Big boy backrests. These things aren't going to rattle or shake or break when you actually got your passengers running 20, 25 miles an hour down the waterway. So this is just a quick preview. The old Ultra 265 Sea Hunt Special Edition Center Console, new for 2021 in the brand new Atlantic Green Hall color that we even did on the underside of the T-top. So it's despite the fact we went stern to bow rather than bow to stern, I wanna thank you for taking a quick minute to watch a video walkthrough in this Ultra 265. I want to encourage you to give us a shout at Southeast Marine at 804-226-1111 or visit us on southeasternmarine.net. And as always, give us a try before you buy. That's Mickey Brown, Southeast Marine, out.